What is going on, everybody? Z here, and welcome back to some more Dual Universe today. So today is going to be something a little bit different. I want to do some ship building. So we we had a fantastic live stream. It was actually absolutely terrible, honestly. But um, and the reason it was terrible is because I kind of destroyed my uh, I kind of I kind of broke my ships a couple of times. We crashed and burned a couple of times. So uh, yeah, so I started working on this thing. And I was like, oh, this is kind of cool. We had a good time with it, but I crashed this one too. And I'm just like, I'm not liking what it is. I'm not liking what's representing here. So we're gonna do something a little bit different. Hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, please don't forget to leave a like. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. Also, if you wanna check out Dual Universe, I have a link down below. It's an affiliate link. You sign up, make an account through there. Shoots a little bit back to me and I do appreciate it. Anyways, okay. So basically what I wanna do here is I want to get rid of all this and I want to start over <laughs> yeah that's what we're gonna do we're gonna have a good time so let me uh let me deconstruct this a little bit all right so thanks for deconstructing this is what we're left with so I have an idea of what I kind of want to do here now um I want to do something that's like not as a box like that was literally just a flying box I didn't like that I didn't like what was going on with it so um I do have like a basic a super basic idea of what I want to get going on here uh, let's go ahead and let's grab some of the, let's grab this and let's just bring out something like this for now. Um, because I want to get an engine shape. There's actually a shape that I kind of want to use for the engines. So we're going to start with that. I'm going to try to get that going and then we'll, uh, we'll kind of see what I get from those. Okay. So this is kind of what I'm thinking for engines. I kind of want to have like a box here, a box here, like a main little thing right here. And then I think we're gonna have two like medium engines up here. Um, but I want to get like the, the shell of these kind of built. So I'm going to build them off of this one. And then we're going to hopefully be able to rotate the entire thing. Okay. So I made a box on this guy. Now let's see if we can do some of this copy pasty stuff. Uh, and we're going to, we're going to try to get fancy here as well as fancy as I can handle, you know, I mean, like there's not a whole lot that I can do, but if we control copy, it's going to give me this option right here. Now, if I bring this like this, I should be able to bring it up and then I should be able to rotate the thing. No, I can't rotate it. Hmm. I was hoping to twist the whole thing, but it looks like we're going to have to make these at 45s. It doesn't look like I'm going to be able to rotate it the way that I was hoping I could. Oh, look at slot the one stop by. Holy moly. That right there is the start of a freighter. Oh my gosh, Kyvin says he's gonna be getting a warp drive by tomorrow. What the heck? I'm just over here trying to make a stupid basic like the ship. <laughs> Everybody's like, I'm gonna be getting a warp drive here soon. It's like, well, thanks guys, thanks, appreciate it. Super excited for you. All right, now I wanna throw on some medium engines as well. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and throw these on uh, probably somewhat like this. So I kind of get this design right here. I'm I'm thinking. Um, I think that should be fine like this. I think that'll be good. I think that'll be good. Okay, so we'll rock with that. Actually, I need to figure out where the bottom of my thing is going to be. Actually, you know what? We'll probably rock with the bottom right there. So that'll be good. So these should be off the ground. Uh, and then let's go ahead and bring those. Let's bring those over and let's bring those up here a little bit. All right, so there's mediums, there's larges. That's kind of what I'm thinking here. And I don't think we'll have an issue with, I don't think we'll have an issue with thrust. I think it'll be fine because I think these are clear enough from these. Now I would have done larges here, but I don't think I really need this craft to be that big. That's not really, really what I'm going for. So we have that, this, these are, you know, the four main engines. Now uh, we need to get a main little capsule here and I need to get these engines like enclosed in something and attached. So I'm hoping to do some kind of like some kind of like wing things like grabs each side like that. But I also want to make the box. I want to make the box at an angle, but that's going to be a lot of it's a lot of little triangles. And I'm not actually 100 percent sure how to do that. Everything right now with the voxel stuff is me just figuring things out as I go. <laughs> OK, so I have boxed in these as well. I'm trying to give some shapes here. Now, uh, nothing here is like final, of course, and I am not, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm not a great ship builder, cosmetic builder, things like that. I have an idea in my mind and I'm trying to make it work. Uh, is it going to work? Probably not, but I'm going to try. <laughs> I am going to try. Now, I really just wish I could get the boxes for these done up. Um, and I don't know like the best way to, to do that because I need, I'm going to need like all like angles on these and I'm not actually sure how to do that yet. So now we have a little bit of a floor here. You can see I put an angle on it. I think we're gonna try to angle these up to these boxes right here. 
Now I have this center area. I'm not exactly sure what I want to do with it. I don't know if I want to cut this out. So it's like open and then like they just end there. I'm not exactly positive. Um, I don't, I don't know yet. So <laughs> one thing at a time, I want to get it so we can, uh, so it can be like semi flyable, but I got to figure out, cause I actually don't have a lot of area to work with on the bottom here. And I want to make sure that I have enough uh hovers and i want to make sure that i have like enough you know enough enough stuff on the bottom to make it you know float <laughs> that's what we want that's what we need so i think i'm gonna actually go ahead and i'm gonna double up the layers on these so that way i can sink the uh the hovers in a little bit more so if i do that and i bring out so let's get our uh let's get large flat hovers right here if i bring these out are these gonna squeeze in right here oh that's gonna be super close Okay, so if I do that, and then I should be able to page up into this. Um, geez, that's hanging out. Okay, so we might actually have to, we might have to enclose this area. Let's see, can I bring it up another one? Oh, I can. And I should actually be able to get two right here. Okay, so let's do that one there. And let's just bring this one straight over this way. And that one won't fit there because of those canisters. Okay, so those canisters must be a hair lower. All right, so let's uh, let's bring those down by one. And then let's bring these up. Perfect. Okay, so there's those. So those two hovers are nice and sunk in there. Those are looking pretty good. Uh, we're going to have to... We're going to seal this stuff up, you know, eventually. So that's two of our hovers. Now, I, I want to throw the rest of them in here underneath of this that way we have like you know plenty of hover power <laughs> i want to make sure i have all the hovers uh and then i also have vertical boosters as well so i might have to actually we're gonna go out of build mode here i'm gonna bring this up a little bit there we go okay so now i'm just going to uh let's go ahead and get these what is that looking like okay so that's looking pretty good let's go ahead and page those up oh it's hitting the canister Hmm. I could always do a third layer right here. We might just do that. I might do actually a third layer right here. So let's go ahead. Let's place that one down. And then let's bring up uh, another one there and another one there. So that's going to give us one, two, three, four, five. That's five hovers. Um, I'm going to throw two vertical boosters, I think, right up in here. So let's go ahead and let's throw another layer of... Uh, of honeycomb on here so now those are kind of sunk in there a little bit that looks that looks all right that looks all right i can deal with that i can deal with that looking good looking good all right perfect so we have those we have those uh i'm gonna throw two vertical thrusters in here hopefully they'll fit or vertical boosters i should say so let's go ahead uh can we sync those up in there now i'm not sure how far those can go in there before they're going to be obstructed so i'm going to just leave it probably like this so we have those two there that's looking pretty good. Okay, so that gives us a lot of uh, a lot of downward thrust. Now, I was actually rethinking this back here because I actually have uh, some compact ailerons, and I think those are actually going to work their way back here. Now, I have a whole bunch of atmospheric brakes, and you throw those on as well. But where did those compact ailerons... Let's place these out. So I'm thinking we're going to throw them like this. And I might actually go get a couple more because those are going to give us some lift. Uh, so that'll be like crucial, absolutely crucial for, uh, for flight. And if I get a couple more on there, that's going to be pretty good. And I have wings, but I'm only, I'm almost thinking that like, I might not, I might not need wings for this. If I can get enough compact ailerons in here, like, I don't, I don't think that's going to be something we're going to necessarily need. Now I'm also trying to decide if I even want to make this space capable right now, because I'm not, I don't think I'm really going to be taking any trips to space. I think I just want it atmosphere capable so I can fly to a, a tile, you know, deposit a whole bunch of ore, things like that. And um, if I do that, I actually don't need these space fuel tanks. So I could throw one of those atmospheric tanks over here. Oh, actually, I do need space fuel for these vertical thrusters. I do indeed. Okay, so we'll just leave those. We'll leave those for now. And then that'll also give me the ability to, if I need to, I can strap on um, some, some space, uh, some space thrusters and uh call that good so we'll just leave those alone for now i know they're just chilling there i know it's not like the most magnificent thing in the world but it's working for now all right so i made my first box 
I guess. And I'm going to have to see how this engine fits in here because I really have no idea. Okay, so there's the rough box design right now. So if I grab this guy, is there a way we can rotate? The oh, that fits. That fits. Uh, never mind. Almost fits. It's sticking out right there, though. If I bring it down one. Oh. Oh. And bring it over like that. How's that going to look? I mean, it doesn't look terrible. It's sticking out right there now. Okay, so it looks like right there might be my only option. So if I place it like that, how's this going to look? Looks like a box. So I think we're just going to try it. I think we're going to try it. It doesn't look the greatest, but uh, eh, we're going to try. <laughs> we're going to try it. So I actually need to, uh, I need to place a thing like right here. Perfect. So I can copy and paste this entire thing. And then I actually got to place one, uh, down here as well. And if I place anything on these, it's going to mess up everything. Uh, that's all right. All right. So let's copy paste this over to that side as well. And just kind of take a peek at what it looks like. All right. We got it moved over. It's, it's symmetrical. It's, it's in the right spot. <laughs> It's in the right spot. Okay, so now I need to bring this down and make sure it's not clipping out. It is. I might actually need to rotate this a little bit. Let's bring it this way. Is that what I had to do on this one? Okay, I would say that looks pretty good. I think that's good. I think our, our, two, little, our two little engine pods are there. I mean, it's it's something. <laughs> it's something. It's not great, but it's something. Okay, so we got some mounts. I made I made a couple of little mounts here. Nothing super amazing. Uh, darn it, that's the wrong tool. That's not what I want. <laughs> uh, nothing super flashy, but they look like they're being held on. There's something going on here. I like it, and I might actually throw some luminescent glass inside of these. I don't know. We're, we're like again, we're making frames here. We're making frames. Um, so let's actually go ahead and pull this guy off of here. Let's do that. So now we have this kind of outlook. Oh, I like it. I'm already liking this so much better than, <laughs> than the last thing. Uh, let's pull this off here. Now I am going to have to do something with these front engines as well. So we're probably going to do something similar, maybe smaller. I don't know. We'll see. Or maybe these, these will be just standard boxes. Um, but we got like finishing touches to do on everything here. Now the seat itself is actually going to be down in here. Uh, let's just set it right there and let's move this like right there. We'll put this like right here. So the seat's actually going to be down in here. Um, and we're going to put some like angles and stuff like that on the top of this guy. You know, I'm like, this guy says it's blocked. I might need to bring it down a hair. Let's bring it down. We'll take it down three. We'll take this one down three as well. Okay. So there's that guy. It says it's blocked, but eh, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Um, ooh, I'm liking it so far. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. <laughs> okay. So we still have hovers there. We still have those there. That's all looking good and fine and dandy. Um, now I need to throw adjusters and things like that on here as well. I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do with the adjusters because uh, adjusters kind of have to go on like on the sides. Actually, you know what? We're probably going to throw, hold on. Let's throw some adjusters on here. So if I throw one like this, I know it's at an angle, but it might work. So if I throw that one like that and I bring one over here, like that. That should give us, that should give us yaw control or not. Yeah, that should get, that should give us roll. Yeah. That should give us roll control. Um, and then as far as pitch, we're going to have to throw something up here. Um, I'd like to, oh, we really need to throw one underneath of here too. I might actually extend the nose of this out so I can throw an adjuster on the bottom there because we need one on the bottom. 
uh probably on the top bottom top and the sides because we need some sides control we could always throw adjusters on the outboards of these as well that might give us a little bit of control okay so we have something like this going on now i do have some i do have medium stabilizers i'm not sure how well these are going to work with this build though i don't know i don't know if i really really like this or not could always throw them down here but i feel like that kind of takes away from uh kind of takes away from the purpose a little bit you know what i mean unless we threw them in here oh that would be kind of cool Oh, they're sticking out, though. They're sticking out of the top. So they would work, but they'd have to go all the way down here. Hmm. That would actually be kind of cool. <laughs> that would be kind of neat. How does that look? Oh, that actually looks kind of cool. It looks kind of cool. <laughs> I actually kind of like that. So we might actually keep those there. That'll give us a little bit of lift. Uh, Not a lot, though. I think we're going to have to go with these compact uh, ailerons right here because that's going to give us a little bit more lift. Uh, so we'll probably stack a few right there. I actually kind of, I kind of like those there. I'm not going to lie. Those actually kind of look pretty neato. I need to do something with these as well. And I need to get some more adjusters on here. Now, I would like to, I'd like to get this to a point where it could fly, but I think we have a lot of work ahead of us still here. Um, and it is, it is still very boxy. It's not finished. We're not doing final touches, you know, things like that. I'm just trying to get the frame of it built. Uh, and then I can go back through and play with it as I need to. But I'm thinking the two large engines and the two medium engines are going to be great because the two large engines take a little, little while to spool up and the two mediums spool up a little bit quicker. So we'll hopefully have that immediate, uh, that a little bit of immediate thrust. And then, oh my gosh, imagine if we could throw some stabilizers. Wait a second. I actually have, um, I have two regular stabilizers. We could always throw these on here as well and that would give us uh that would give us a little bit more control let's see how does how's this gonna look it's actually not bad it's actually not bad i'm actually kind of liking how it's looking so far <laughs> ah! okay so last thing we're gonna do is i actually want to throw my gear on here now, I want to get these kind of hidden away. So let's see if I can get these squeezed in here. Mm, it doesn't look like it's going to go in there very well. And it's because it's hitting. It's because it's hitting right there. It's hitting on those guys. So how would I want to do this? Would I want to make a separate little box right here? Because, I mean, we could make a separate little box thing right there. I'm not sure that I actually like that, though. I, I mean, I would like gear, but how bad do I want? I mean, I could bring this out by one. We could bring the back end, and back end of this out a little bit, but I kind of like how it is right now where it ends like it is. And then these guys are sitting pretty good like that. You know, I might just do that. I think we're going to do that like that. Um, I think we're going to rotate it around and we're going to do one exactly in the same place on the other side. Just like that. That's good that will work we'll go ahead and we'll uh ooh, i might bring these in by one because i don't really like how they're they're freaking out like this that looks good and we'll bring this in by one as well perfect okay so that looks good we have some little tiny gear right there and then i have extra small gear that we'll throw on the front here now i kind of want these to be sitting at the same height so I feel like that's probably good there. And we'll just go ahead and bring another one right over here. Like that. And then we have some gear. And then those will get sucked up while we're flying. Oh my gosh, I'm loving this thing so much. <laughs> I'm loving it so much. But that's going to end this episode. This is our first little ship building kind of thing. Um, I figured maybe you guys would enjoy. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. And like I said, if you want to check out the game, links down below. That'll That's a little affiliate link, so it shoots a little bit back my way. Also, if you want to join the org, uh, you go into orgs, search Z-O-N-E, Z-Zone, essentially, Z-1. 
and uh, we're recruiting. Oh, goodness. We got a whole bunch of people. Look at that. What's up, everybody? <laughs> Over 200 members, heck yes. But yes, thank you again for coming out. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Um, also, if you guys want to catch some live stream action, twitch.tv slash gaming. That's where I do the things live. That's where we burnt our ships, ships up, and it was absolutely terrible. It was terrible. It was a horrible, awful disaster. But hopefully we can get this thing go rock and rolling. Hopefully it'll, uh, it'll fly. It'll be good, but I'm excited. And uh, yeah, you have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.